Hey, what is going on, guys, gals, aliens, and DJ and freaks? So I, by doing a little bit of research, know exactly what you guys want to know from me. And it is some information about some altcoin gems. And we are going to analyze XYO, and that is the XYO network. So let's just get right into it. So your data just got better. So what is XYO? XYO is an altcoin gem that is uh, in the narrative of securing data. So right now, the biggest narrative for um, Amazon and uh, all these different companies that are uh, affiliated with gathering massive amounts of data, they're needing a lot more infrastructure and they're gonna be using blockchain. And so Oracle's, what they do is provide off-chain and on-chain data with price, uh, 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 to change prices, uh, to have it, you know, it's just like, that's a, a one example that for instance, like Chainlink uses, um, they use, uh, the markets, crypto markets use Chainlink, which is an Oracle to, um, aggregate, um, price, um, prices for assets in exchanges. So, uh, all of this data has to be provided on chain and off chain to make sure there's no discrepancies. So what XYO does is does a similar thing. So it's time to stop creating messy, unreliable, and average data. XYO's protocol creates an organized long-term solution for any kind of your data you're making today. And most importantly, XYO's decentralized system ensures you can trust that data you're using all day, every day. So uh, they're featured on Coinbase, Crypto.com, uh, partnered with Chainlink as well. And so they're just there. Uh, we're tired of data being good enough. All XYO products create, uh, create great data in three ways, data sovereignty, provenance, and permanence. At the end of the day, these three things are all that matter for creating reliable, usable, and great data. So what you can do is uh, you can actually, um, I think you can have your, you can run your own node. Uh, so you can uh, validate uh, data transactions uh, through a node, uh, through their ecosystem. So you can, yeah, node.xyonet, create bound witnesses with your computer. And so, to get a little bit into uh, the price, so the price right now is sitting at 0.02 cents and 0.002 cents. And you can see here that compared onto BTC, we saw two different highs. So this was the high of, of Bitcoin right here in 2018. And then this was a similar high on uh, 2018 with XYO. And then you can see here that if we just clear uh, clear Bitcoin off of this chart and we just look at the actual price movements here all time, then you can see here that at the uh, part of the peak of the bull market 2021, we saw a high of four cents and then we went as high as seven cents. But if we want to get into uh, some other interesting uh, things about XYO is that they're involved in the metaverse. And so when it comes to all of this different data that has to go back and forth, I think uh, one of the things that we can, another narrative is the metaverse. So XYO is a technology protocol that is designed to improve the validity, certainty, and value of data. The platform claims to build a robust data marketplace that allows users to interact with verifiable data. The XYO network currently has over 5 million nodes and claims that platform is to be the first reality oracle. XYO aims to increase the trust for data within Web3 platforms and provides absolute ownerships of data to their owners. The innovative data management project XYO comes at a time when the world is shifting to big data and decisions are essentially data driven. And this is from uh, Cryptopolitan. This was uh, um, in a list of other coins uh, that we are familiar with. And then if you want to get into the price predictions of 2023 to 2020, uh, 2030, will XYO coin reach $1, $10 or $100? Uh, I would say for, for it to reach a dollar, you know, let's, all right, so let's see. Uh, so this is some awesome news here. So XYO has partnered with Netflix to allow users to track their spending habits on the platform using XYO's Forventary 
uh, platform. The partnership with Netflix will allow users to track their spending on the platform in real time and to see how their spending habits change over time. As we can see, there hasn't been much change in XYO's trading volume over the past month. And we can see here that the, the trading volume uh, we can see here, we got the highest trading volume at Ladukin uh, Exchange. And I'm not familiar with that exchange, but that has the most 24 hour volume. But you can see the second is Coinbase. So if you're wanting to purchase XYO, you can purchase it on Coinbase, but then you can also purchase it on familiar exchanges like Gate.io, uh, Qcoin, and you can also uh, do trading pairs in Uniswap and uh, some other decentralized pairs. So, um, uh, going back to this article, uh, so we can see uh, that, however, it spiked to a high of 4.1 million before dropping to 282K. XYO's trading volume has fallen by almost 40% in just the last day. Um, but this uh, was from September. So this analysis right here, just talking about the actual movements on, on, the sh on uh, that time frame. So if we look... You know, will XYO coin reach a dollar? XYO needs to rise 142 times to reach a price level of a dollar. And note that the XYO coin reached its all time high value of seven cents, which we just evaluated in November of 2021. And so the thing with XYO, which is interesting, is that I've, I've seen it pump substantially. And uh, this is a coin that I've, that I've had off and on, you know, I was, you know, I've taken profits on it, I've, I've owned it, I've not owned it. And it's something that, you know, when you're trying to see what altcoins are going to outperform in the short term on Bitcoin, whenever it whenever Bitcoin pumps and also Ethereum, you can kind of see where you can take your profits and then just put it back into Bitcoin and back into Ethereum, because then at the points where the altcoin market is booming, that's when you can go back in and you secure your profit. So this could be a potential coin, you know, um, you know, for me uh, that I would love to uh, accumulate a little bag of, uh, take the profits when we see the bull market hit, and then, you know, it's kind of off to the races. So let's look at some other on-chain data. Uh, we have 88,000 holders, a circulating supply of 13.47 billion. The market cap is a small market cap. We're only at 38 million. So the market cap is very, very, very small. Uh, the liquidity, I'd say, is pretty, pretty low. I'd say the liquidity is pretty low. Uh, total market cap, 39 million. And uh, the 24 hour volume is almost at um, almost at a million at a million. So I, I XYO is definitely uh, if you're wanting to go for the narrative of data and secure data, uh, you know, it's, so if you want to add something like XYO and Chainlink and, and, you know, things like that, there might be some other ones. You know, if you go to coin market cap and you and you look at um, Oracle projects uh, in the uh, list of coin market cap. If we go to the types of projects that are in the Oracles, we can, you know, you can do that, but I I'd let you guys do that. But for now, just uh, check out uh, XYO and let me know what you guys think about this project. Um, let me know if you liked my little, little review here and the price analysis. And let me know if you want me to talk about any other altcoins and uh yeah hit the like button didn't say that yet hit the like button hit the subscribe button and hit the bell to be notified when we make new cryptocurrency videos and i will see you guys in the next altcoin deep dive peace